Typically, more than one prototype is necessary when developing a new product. The first prototype, otherwise called alpha, is typically the early stage prototype that is built to demonstrate the overall ergonomics, the, the size, the shape of your product, uh, maybe also to test some basic functionality. Uh, then after alpha prototype, typically you work on design improvements and modifications and then build what's called the beta prototype, which is a new and improved version of the prototype based on the revised design. Sometimes more than two prototypes are necessary. Uh, I would say on average our customers go through anywhere between two to four prototypes before they hit the mass production stage. Uh, in some instances, you may get away with just a couple. In some instances, you may need to have 200 prototypes. Although like in, when we talk about hundreds, that's probably like closer to extremes. And we probably talk about smaller products that can be prototyped real quick, um, quickly. And, uh, but overall, like the more prototypes you develop and you test, uh, the better your product is going to be. Although it's important to find the right balance between the amount of time and money you spend on prototyping and the results you get out of it. If you feel like um, the investment into further prototyping is not gonna result in the sufficient outcome, then it's probably about time to launch your product.